Kevin Price and John Swantek go head to head. All right, head to head once again with my man Kev here. We're going to try to determine what's a truer test of earning your PGA Tour card. A tough track like Canterbury in Cleveland last week, an easy track like Hillcrest here in Boise. I think a hard course like last week at the DAP Championship, seven under the winning score for Bryson DeChambeau. That proves a player's medal, right? John, you've got to be kidding me. The easier track is the best test of how a guy is going to fare on the PGA Tour. On the big tour, you need to make a lot of birdies to keep your card and contend. You've got to make those 20 to 25 footers. Yeah, Hillcrest might not be the most tough track. The rough isn't as sick as Canterbury. The greens aren't as fast. But at the same time, you got to make those putts to get up on the leaderboard. you got to make a lot of birdies. That that's what's going to translate over to the PGA Tour. When you're on the PGA Tour, there's a lot of moments when you're not comfortable. When you're going 20 under par, you're comfortable. You're firing at flags. You're freewheeling it. When you're five under par, like Andrew Luke was to win in Columbus at the Scarlet Course last year, that's when you're uncomfortable. That's when you know you're ready for the PGA Tour. Knowing that you have to shoot five under each day to keep pace, that's not comfortable. That's pressure. You have a 15-footer, you're like, I got to make this? That's pressure. You don't have that ability to make pars to kind of keep your ground. You need to keep going pedal to the metal, keep going low. That's that comfort zone that you don't have. On the PGA Tour, you're going to have to find it. We've got two tough courses, two relatively easy courses of the four in the finals. 